The following segment is sponsored by Ward MD and Form Derm Spa. I am here with Dr. Powers and Dr. Iorio from Form Derm Spa. Ladies, thank you so much for joining me today. Yes, thanks thank you. so much for having us. Yes, great to see you. Thanks for coming back. Okay, so today we're going to break down the difference between medical surgery and cosmetic surgery. They're both surgery, right? Yeah. Right. So we oftentimes are talking about rhinoplasty in our practice, which the layman term for that is a nose job. And so there's different categories that that falls into. One category is cosmetic, where a patient may not have any breathing issues through their nose, they're breathing totally fine, but they're saying, you know what, I really don't like the hump on my nose, or I really don't like the way that my tip is kind of drooping, or I have a bulbous tip, meaning it's a wide looking tip. Okay. So we have patients that are coming in and talking to us about that and saying, you know, I'd love to change the shape of my nose in order to fit my face better. Okay, great. And what's the other side of it, too? So the other one we call functional, or just helping functional. the function of your nose, which is to breathe. Which is kind of important. <laughs> yeah, so that's the main thing that the nose does for us, as Dr. Powers mentioned. And so you can have a combo case, or where you combine cosmetic and functional. Functional being breathing. So the septum is the middle structure of your nose. If that's crooked, it can block one side of your nose. You can also have what's called nasal valve collapse, where you breathe in, it actually creates a vacuum, and your nose collapses in on itself. So then you can't breathe as well. And so we can fix those at the same time as we do cosmetic surgeries as well, but that would be the functional component. Okay, oh, that's so nice. We can do both. Now, combo surgery. Right. Yeah. That's an option. Yep, that is an option. So functional, if you just did functional alone, you said, you know, I'm just getting my nasal breathing better. We're not going to leave you with a nose that looks inappropriate for your face, but it's not that you're making those changes for a cosmetic reason. Then there's the patients that are really in the middle of that category. They're hybrid, right? They're not breathing well. Maybe they had an accident. They were playing soccer. They broke their nose when they were a kid. And also, they don't like the hump on their nose. And so really, we have a combination case for them. And again, we're addressing the nasal breathing at that time, as well as the way that the nose is looking. Sure. Now, what's the best first step to take? Should we come in for a consultation? What would you both suggest? Yeah, coming in for a consult is the best best way to know if you're a good candidate, to understand why you're not breathing well through your nose. And we're actually doing a free CT scan screening on December 20th, so you can call in. We are um, accepting walk-ins that day as well. And what that allows us to see are the bony structures of the nose as well as the septum further back. Sure. And what are you seeing with the after results? I mean, it really is life-changing, right? It really is. So immediately after surgery, you actually aren't able to breathe well at all for about a week just due to splinting in the nose. But almost as soon as those come out in clinic after that one week, everyone just has a life-changing moment because they can finally breathe. Most people say like they didn't know that this is how normal people breathe their whole lives. So that part is great. And then you take the cast off and you get to see the cosmetic portion. Everything's very swollen initially, and it takes actually, some people say, to usually about a year, but some people actually say 18 months for the nose to completely heal. Okay. So you're looking at a year and a half of full recovery, but the most of it's in the beginning. Well, and imagine how you're going to feel after, right. you know, just so much better, especially if you're not liking the look of your nose. And then also if you can breathe again, which would be really nice. If we want to make an appointment for a consultation. Where can we yeah. go for more information? So you can go to Form Derm Spa, or you can call us at 801-513-3223. Perfect. Dr. Iorio and Dr. Powers, thank you so much for thank joining us. Thank you. Great to see you.